and welcome back guys so we're going to enter the lucky 38 we're going to deposit some of our stuff and get ready to start doing main questing uh, we're going to be doing primarily yes man and the ncr questing uh, the goal will be to try to get every ending as we can but there's only some endings we can get so we'll try uh, make sure you hit that like button make sure Make sure you hit the subscribe button, make sure you hit the like button. Let's go play some quality videos. Well, howdy, partner. Good to see you again. Boss is waiting for you upstairs, so get a move on. I see you brought some friends. Sorry, partner, but they're gonna have to stay outside. Come back soon now.
Where to, partner? This meeting has been a long time coming, hasn't it? You've come a long ways, literally, and I suspect, figuratively as well. I have to ask, now that you've reached your destination, what do you make of what you see? Of course you haven't. Vegas always was one of a kind. What you see down on the Strip is just a fraction of the city's former glory, and yet, more than an echo, I preserved its spirit. Or perhaps you were referring to the Lucky 38? The years haven't been kind to her, but still she manages to impress. Oh, don't be coy. You've been playing a high-stakes game ever since Victor dug you out of the ground. Don't be afraid to admit it. The business is this. One of my employees has stolen an item of extraordinary value from me. And I want it recovered. Simple enough. My only concern is the recovery of the Platinum Chip. What happens to Benny, I leave to your discretion. When you bring the chip to me, I will pay you four times the delivery bonus stipulated in your contract. How's that? Well enough. Return to me when you have the platinum chip in your possession. Any final matters for us to discuss? Congratulations, partner. The boss has instructed me to come you to the high roller suite. You can bring your friends too. Be like a little clubhouse for the gang you put together. Just bear in mind, you're the only one gets to see the boss. Any friends you got, they can wait in the suite. Enjoy the dates, partner. They're plenty fancy. Hey, you there. I have a message for you. It's from Ambassador Crocker. Very important. Here you go. Aww.
Where to, partner? Making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you?
got something good. Where to, partner? Casino floor. Hello again. Well, I suppose you could look at it that way, but I was packing a whole different kind of heat. No, escort just sounds better than man whore. Yep, I was damn good at my job, too. But after a while, I just felt like a piece of meat and had to quit. My father ran a butcher shop here in town, but business went downhill when another vendor started selling this strange meat at half our prices. You're telling me, not long after my father's shop went under and he passed away from the loss, People around town started experiencing shakes. No one gets shakes like that unless they're eating human flesh. But no one would believe me. The sick bastard gradually went insane and passed away. Wasn't long before someone moved into the guy's place and found half-buried human remains in the crawl space. I didn't bother saying... After a while, I made enough money to get a passport into Vegas. Back then... Well, being a suave young guy, I chatted up the... I never touched a woman, but the jealous prick... Sure enough, a few grand... Yeah, but what can you do? I was stripped of my casino apartment and all of my belongings, and booted back into... From there, I didn't have a lot of career options, as my rep was destroyed. When I quit the escort job, I had enough money to buy a pistol belt and some... Bodyguards make it... After saving a few tourists from truck. Exactly one of the re... I'm retired, but life has been a bit dull without some kind of action. What's the job? Ah, I get you. So you think because of my past escort work, I'd be interested in that kind of thing. I got out of that work because it just made me feel empty inside. What makes you think I would ever go back to that degradation? Sorry, friend, but I just can't do it. Hello again. I'm ret- Ah, I get you. You know what? You're right. I looked at the whole thing from the wrong angle. I suppose I could be a loving muse to some, while simply relieve stress and tension in others. Thanks for that insight. Tell Garrett I'd be happy to start at the Wrangler immediately. This should be a nice change of pace from retirement.
Welcome back. What the... And who would that be? I've heard some stories of that old guy. I'm amazed he's still alive with how much he's been through. If the stories are true, he'll be a valuable commodity here at the Wrangler. I appreciate the find. Some gamblers came in saying they'd seen you enter the Lucky 38. I have to say, I'm impressed. I don't know of any other living person who's been in there. I don't care how you handled those lumps of human refuse, but you got the job done. We need you to hunt down another person. That son of a bitch McCaffrey stole a ton of caps and ran off to Va- No one steals from the garret. See the king. Just bring back his hat if you decide to take... I doubt much of that. Yes! Where's his hat? This is great news. No one screws with the Garrett twins and gets away with it. I need to find a place on the wall for this. And for your reward, here's 150 caps. I trust there were also some valuables on McCaffrey. Also, we would like to set you up with a room. You can have the corner room, rent-free. It was McCaffrey's. Now that he's dead, we're happy to let you use it. Thanks for helping us. See ya. for all your shopping needs. One of my aides said you got into the Lucky 38. If you see someone by the name of Emily near there, we would like you to work for us. That's 
phenomenal. Who did you find? They supply Freeside with drugs and liquor. From my point of view, they're just better organized pushers. Upgrading their stills would increase their supply of liquor and chems. How does that help Freeside? Good point. We wouldn't be paying anything for their supplies, just a portion of our food waste to make ethanol. We get food from nearby wasteland farmers in exchange for medical services, so we could put our caps back into helping Freeside. Tell the Garretts we'll keep their stills running if they provide us with supplies. Thank you for arranging this. You've been a godsend. Hi, do you need assistance? Only a little. A friend of mine, Major Elizabeth Kieran, has been handing out supplies to the poor a little west of here. What about it? I know something's got them riled up, but I've been too busy with other matters to really look into it. If you're looking into the matter, talk to Elizabeth. She's in charge of the operations here in Freeside, though she won't open up to you right away. If Elizabeth holds out on you, tell her that I sent you. She should be a little more forthcoming if you mention my name. Was there anything else you wanted to talk about? Alright guys, so that looks like it's going to be in the end of the video here. Make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe button, and I'll see you again in the next video.